People are always driving, and people will continue driving in the future. Sure, driving is getting more energy efficient with electric vehicles and more fuel efficient vehicles, but what if cars aren't the problem? Of course, reducing the number of cars on the road would greatly decrease the amount of fuel mixing with our air, but not everybody in the world is going to stop driving and start looking for alternate ways to commute. This is why I think that solar panels that can be driven and walked on is a mechanical engineering innovation that will change the world for the better. If you think about it, the idea of solar roads really makes sense. Roads and sidewalks are facing the sun for most of the day, so why not have them generate power while doing so? How would this work, you might ask? Well, solar panels would collect energy from the sun during the daytime, and when cars pass over the solar panels, they would also collect energy. Same goes for sidewalks. As people walk on the solar panels, it gathers electricity, which can then be used for other purposes. Solar roads would not just be producing electricity during the daytime. Headlights from vehicles traveling at night would also cause the solar panels to generate energy. Creating solar roads does not mean ripping apart every single road and building a new one. Since the road is already there, solar panels will just be integrated into the road. There are many perks to having solar panels that can be driven or walked on. The most obvious one being that it is energy efficient, partly made of recycled glass, and generates its own power, which can be used to power businesses and houses nearby. The energy could also fuel electric cars and maybe one day possibly charge electric vehicles as they are driving on the solar panels. Although this energy does not need to be used right away, it can also be stored in batteries for later use. Another pro to having solar roadways is that they would eliminate potholes from the road finally, creating quite a few happy drivers since there would be no need to swerve around potholes anymore. This would also lead to less maintenance of roads and sidewalks, which would reduce the number of road closures and detours for drivers. The solar panels would also be free of ice and snow due to a heating element in the panels. This could greatly reduce the number of accidents on the road since there would be better road conditions. It would also require less work for city and provincial crews when it comes to clearing snow after a large snowstorm. Another interesting aspect of these solar panels is that they would contain LED lights to define lanes and any other signals associated with those lanes. For example, if one lane is a right turning lane, the LED lights could show a right turn arrow on the lane. These lights could also indicate bicycle lanes and bus lanes as well as the posted speed limit. This would eliminate paint from being used on the road and would once again require less maintenance since it would not be necessary to repaint lines on the roadways. Where there are some pros, there are also some cons, the biggest one being cost. Since these solar panels, especially those in high traffic areas, will get driven on quite frequently, they will be subject to a lot of wear and tear and will need to be replaced more frequently. This makes maintaining the solar panels quite expensive. Another challenge for solar roads and sidewalks is the temperature. As I mentioned earlier, the panels contain a heating element so that the panels stay clear of snow and ice. However, if the temperature of the panels gets too high, the panels become less efficient and produce less power. Although the panels have been tested and can withstand the weight of a semi-truck, safety is still a big issue. There is no clear indicator of how the panels will hold up in high traffic areas. Some testing has been done to ensure that vehicles going high speeds can still stop within the required distance on the solar panels. However, more simulations are needed to guarantee the durability of solar sidewalks and roads. Driving will always be a part of everyday life for many people across the globe. As fuel efficient and electric cars start to make their mark in this world, it only makes sense for energy efficient roads to develop alongside these innovations. Although there is still lots of work and testing to be done and challenges to overcome, this concept of driving and walking on solar panels would most definitely impact the world in a positive way. Solar panels that can be driven on, walked on, and parked on will provide better driving conditions all year round, make road maintenance easier and faster for workers, and substantially decrease greenhouse gas emissions.